Hey everybody, I hope everything's going well. It's time for another Walk and Talk. You know, this past weekend in the U.S., I'm going to apologize in advance to our international friends, but I hope at the end you'll get something out of this that you can uh, better relate to. So this past weekend here in the U.S. was the start of college football season. And uh, American football, I got I was watching it with my brother, and I got to got to really watching it close and thinking that you know, the, the wide receiver, the person that's supposed to catch the pass, um, they, they go out and, and they need a certain talent and they need to then go catch that pass. And they may catch it and they may not. But how they catch it or if they catch it may depend on whether the quarterback puts it in the right place. May depend on how they run the route. The quarterback being able to put it in the right place depends on how they accomplish their part of the task. The, the, whether the quarterback can get the ball to where it needs to be can be dependent on whether the people on the line block the defense people so that they can't get to the quarterback and he can get the ball to the, to the wide receiver. So really it's not just about the receiver catching the pass. That's what looks good. That's the flair. That's where, that's where we think things are successful or we think things fail. But we have to think about this as a bigger system. It's about the way the coach coaches. All of those systemic efforts have everything to do with the success, whether the team wins or loses, whether that play wins or loses. And I just want to leave you with one thing, and then I want you to think about the sports that you're involved with, the sports that matter to you and your organization. And that is that a single individual can sometimes do something that will make the team successful. But it is very, very rare that a single individual failure causes a team to fail. This is Rob Fisher. This is another Walk and Talk. I hope you can find a sport or something around you that this relates to. Uh, share this with your friends and colleagues. And uh, remember, in, <laughs> intentional leadership starts with you.